The island nation of Tonga still reeling and assessing the damage tonight from this weekend tsunami, which was triggered by a volcanic eruption. You can see the catastrophic event that we're still learning about, the full extent of which, because the damage from the eruption severed communication lines. But the United Nations is saying some of the islands suffered catastrophic damage. Eruptions happen here and there. To ever get this drastic, I don't think they were expecting it. Hawaii is also a volcanic island chain, of course, but scientists say our volcanoes don't, pie, don't pose rather that same kind of danger. Now, that doesn't mean we're completely out of the woods, though. Sam Spangler explains in a story that's new at 10. A volcano based Sequest Hawaii, one of the businesses hit hard by the tsunami, with a propane tank ripped from its mount, as well as about $75,000 in damage. That includes approximately 80% of their merchandise. It was a tsunami that came without much warning. After seeing the, uh, the satellite animations of the eruption cloud, I wasn't surprised that the, the kind of acoustic effects, you know, throughout the atmosphere, but it is surprising to see how far a tsunami propagated from this event. Even catching scientists off guard. We're used to being able to take the pulse of our volcanoes in real time. So think Kilauea, there's thousands of instruments on the volcano. We need to be aware, I think, as a, a global community, and especially here in the Pacific, that the vast majority of volcanoes on the planet are actually submarine. And many of them are in the same category as that one. The submarine volcano, unlike our shield volcanoes in Hawaii, in makeup. Our volcanoes can be somewhat explosive, but even with our submarine volcanoes like Loihi off of Hawaii Island, don't expect anything resembling what happened in Tonga. It's about 3,000 feet below the surface. So at that depth, all it's going to do really is make lava flows and small explosions that, you know, if there's an explosion, it's going to be contained in the water column. The Pacific is something to keep an eye on. An eruption big enough could even change the temperature of our atmosphere. This is how Earth works. And our best defense as, as a society is to gain as much knowledge ahead of time as possible. For more from Sequest Hawaii and impacts on Tonga, you can head over to our website, khon2.com. Sam Spangler, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.